Um, well, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to another video. It is January 15th today. It's actually close to the Bo season, so RIP, but we're down here on the current river today. My buddy, Tim, you saw me in the last video, and my dad, we're down here doing some fly fishing. So, just got pulled up. We're trying to get our fishing in early. We got like 30 minutes till sunset. So, but we're starting fishing right here. So, we'll see. Should be good. All right, here we go, folks. I've actually seen a lot of caddis start to hatch. So that's probably what I'll end up going to, but starting off with a Pertagon to a Pat's rubber legs. That's what I caught a majority of my fish on last time I was down here in the fall. So, yeah, see how we do. All right, folks, I'm not sheen enough. They're hitting cat is good. I want to get on a dry bite, so I'm going to switch it up here to the old classic elk hair caddy. Hi right, folks, quick squish through and we're back in the game. I'll care caddy. Caddy seems to be hatching pretty good in there. They're eating them pretty good, so we'll see. Ooh, that's a nice round. I got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dude, you foul hooked him. What? <laughs> you must have swept at it. That's a massive round. <laughs> <laughs> that's really good. Oh. Isn't he? Yeah. You're right there. All right. Oh, well, good morning, folks. It is the next day. So I didn't really film too much last night, but. We didn't catch anything uh, at a at tan bat. Came back here, cooked a really good dinner, and just came to Montauk State Park because there's nobody else here, so we camped by the river tonight. But it was really windy, really rainy, really stormy last night. But weather's good now, so we're good. It's still pretty windy out, but oh, looking forward to the day. So it's about 7 o'clock right now, so we're just getting the camp packed up here. Got some oatmeal going, maybe some burgers going for breakfast. That'd be pretty good. And then we're going to hit the water, so... Oh, I'm tired, but I'm excited. So hopefully see you guys out on the water. All right, folks, here we go on the river now. I'm um, got my old double nymph rig rigged up here. Got the uh, pants rubber legs to a Pertagon. That's pretty much what I've been just using this winter in Missouri. Um, put some working for me. So just starting here, but we have my buddy still getting rigged up. Let's see. This is right where he caught that nice brown yesterday. Oh, shoot, one to surface right there, actually. Oh my gosh. First cast hung up. That's a great, great start to the morning. <laughs> oh, what a great start. Just busted up this run. Untangle my fly from the thorns. Gotta love it. Right. All right. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Nice fish. Yeah, nice fish. Nice brown, dude. Yeah. Oh, 
Yes, sir. There you go. Uh, yeah, dude, I, I just let it drift down there with a tight line and he munched it. Let's go, baby. First fish. Yeah, that's a wilder. Perfect, man. Here we go, folks. First brown, first fish of the day. Nice, beautiful wild brown. Isn't that fast stuff, too? Oh, yeah, they like, they like the fast stuff. Right, let's get over to the shore. They like the fast stuff. Sure. All right, here we go, folks. First fish of the day. Beautiful wild brown. Oh, he's ready to go. Sir, baby. Let's go. Now the skunk's off, now we can only start catching him. All right, folks, seen a lot of surface here, like a lot of surface. So we're tying on back on the trusty elk here caddis that didn't work last night, but we're seeing a lot. My dad said he just caught one on it. So, see, this will do the trick. I'm trying to talk quiet because I don't want to spook these fish. Yeah. There he is. I got him. Uh, can't, uh, it's brown. There we go, folks. Nice, beautiful brown on the elk hair caddis. Yeah, we, these things are pretty. Yeah, we, beautiful brown there. Yeah, that was sick. I saw him come, come up and swipe at it. I was sort of reaching down to uh, turn the camera off, but I didn't. Guy came up and munched it. Oh, there he goes. Okay. See you, buddy. RIP to the uh, release video there. But there we go. So far, we're. 100% brown today, which doesn't bother me at all. Yeah, wait, that was pretty sweet. Yeah, I hadn't thrown right there, and he just came up and <laughs> sorked her in. Good fish, good fish. Well folks, wasn't recording, I don't think, but just got this absolutely beautiful brown out of this rapid area. God, wait, this thing's pretty. Golly, look at this fish, guys. That is just an absolute meat whistle right there. All right, folks, really nice brown here. Absolutely beautiful fish. He's ready to go. Let's go, baby. All right, folks, let me show you what he uh, came on here. So he came on this egg-sucking leech down to a little, little pertigan. This thing is just been absolutely clutch for the uh, current. And he came out of this riffle. Like, I'm just kind of tight lining it. And then right at the end of the swing, Doink, there he is. That was a meaty son of a gun. Sorry, I don't know about, I think I clicked the button. I must have already been recording. And then, I don't know. But sorry I didn't get it on film. But yeah, he came just like right at the end of this swing here. Picked it up. Do I want on right now? 
Oh, got another one on. Oh gosh. Old Chubster. Old Chubster. I'm like, I think I feel something. Chubby. That's the current river, baby. All right, well, a snack break. You got a little uh, ABC bar, already been chewed bar from uh, Trader Joe's here. I don't know, I just picked them up from the uh, store. Mm. Wow. Kind of tastes like the desert. But, overall, it'll be a 6 out of 10. Almond butter in there is pretty good. But, oh boy. Gotta fuel the fishing somehow. Alright, folks. Snack breaks over, water breaks over. Back to fishing here. Yeah, I got him. There we go, folks. Got a little floppy guy here. Oh yeah, beautiful little brown there. He yeah, that guy came on the uh, Perdigon. He has really pretty colors there. He might be a wild guy. Been a hot night since I caught a fish, so wasn't eat was not on the film there. But guy, look at the dims on that thing. He has a really pretty tail. There he goes. Well, folks, we are back at the house, as you can probably tell. Realized, didn't make an outro like a dummy. I think I always do that. I was in my garage talking to you like a couple days later on the editing, which is my bad. But we're back, as you can tell. Um, ended up being a pretty fun day on the current. I apologize. I was editing it. I'm like, wow, didn't I have like a lot condensed and like nothing? Like, really, I think I caught my last. I caught that second bigger brown at like 10.30 and we fished until like 2. So I ended up catching that one smaller brown like right at the end. So it was a pretty slow day after the morning, but pretty fun morning. Cut those two nice browns and then two smaller ones. So pretty good day. Better than I was expecting, honestly. So, but in case you guys didn't catch it, my rig, I was using a double nymph rig under an indicator. It was a Pat's rubber legs to a Pertagon. Um... I was actually switching between the pats and a like a, an egg sucking leech on the top. I didn't catch it on any of those. They were all on the Pertagon. So yeah, pretty fun day. They were eat, they were hitting the drives pretty good. Um, couldn't really capitalize on that too much, but yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. And yeah, thanks for watching. Hopefully I'll catch y'all on the next one.